Hi, this is Christoph and this video is about how to export overlays from Elastic to the hard disk um, um, into normal image files. And to start, um, I'll start Elastic here from the console. And the first thing I will do is just create an example project um, and there I add some 3D data. So I select these neurons H5 here and maximize the window a bit. So I can use the control key on my mouse wheel to zoom in. And as you see, this uh, is a three-dimensional data set uh, with neurons. And yeah, for our example tasks, we just want to distinguish the boundary from um, the interior of the cell. So I go to classification and select some features. Just let me select this column here without the orientation group and after the features are computed I create two label classes and just marking the background or the interior uh, with red and I mark the boundary in green. Okay I change to the live prediction mode and okay this is fine for now and the first thing I have to do is to predict the whole volume. I use the train and predict button and now the whole volume is uh, predicted and you see here in the overlay we have several overlays and uh, let's have a look at the segmentation so which is just a threshold and let's assume um, you want to export this um, um, this overlay to further post process it so what you can do is just right click on the overlay and use the export option and now this dialog asks me for a few things uh, the first thing is uh, where to put all those files and I just select uh, a folder and I create a new one for that. I just call it a segmentation. And I also can add a prefix for all these files, so I just call them uh, neurons. And I choose the file type uh, as being PNG. So now the uh, the stack is exported, or this overlay is exported, and I just have a look how it looks like. So I go to my desktop, open the segmentation folder, and there you see lots of files and I can open them and go through them and you see the whole stack is exported and it just gives um, a number here for uh, the Z slice so Z slice 1, Z slice 2, Z slice 3 and just let me give another example I go back to Elastic and maybe I'll have a look at, uh, um, at the probability map for boundary and of course I can also export this um, I go with right click to export and it asks me the same thing and I just create a new folder and I'll call this prediction and as prefix I select boundary and now I want to export it not to uh, uh, a stack of images but want to pack it, it into a H5 file so I can use this option here uh, so export it to H5 and now let's see what happened so we have this new folder prediction here and there's a single um, H5 file which is called boundary and to um, to look into this file um, I use the HDF view tool which comes along um, HDF5 so I open a new console and start this HDF view tool and in here I can open um, HDF5 files so I go to my um, to my desktop to the prediction folder and open this boundary H5. There you see we have this hierarchical structure. So um, this is a classification result. It's a prediction and it's a prediction of label one. And in here you see um, that we have a three-dimensional volume with size of 150 cubed. And of course you can also um, parse this file and uh, read the data out of it and reuse it for further post-processing. So I hope. Uh, this will help you in exporting your overlays and yeah, well, enjoy!